Welcome back, MG fam, to another episode of the New York Knicks Rebuild here on NBA Live 10. If you're not already a part of the MG fam, just hit that subscribe button below. And yo, leave a like on the video and holler at your boy in the comments if you got some feedback. But let's get to it. In this episode, we will be going up against the Orlando Magic, who is currently the number one seed in the Eastern Conference, and we are one of the worst teams. You can see by the record, 28 and 50 for us, and 50 and 28. This will be the season finale for us because we're not going to the playoffs. But let's look at the MVP race. LeBron James right now is the leader of the MVP race, and he's doing his thing. You're not surprised that LeBron James is the leader after the season he's having. And next up is Dwayne Wade, man. Maybe these guys meet up in the offseason and get on to Miami like they did in real life. But Steve Nash, Stir, and Kobe Bean Bryant, fourth in the MVP race. And Melo is there, baby, in the fifth place, trying to get in there for his first MVP of his career. So, you know, we were expecting these five guys to be at least in the talks or at least near the top of the MVP race. So we're not surprised. Next up, we're going to check out the ESPN mock draft. They got us in the lottery, man. We may not choose any one of these guys if they're not a transcending talent. And all of the talks around the draft has been like, hey, there's nobody in this draft that's going to take over the league. So we may end up trading this pick to get, you know, a buddy superstar or a young player that may be help James Harden get over the top, man. Because this is a quick rebuild. This is not no five season, 10 season rebuild. We need to get it right now, baby. So right now we're going to get into this game against the Orlando Magic. Maybe we can get this upset at the end of the season. The Amway Arena is lit up. They're very happy, this fan base, that their team is in contention for an NBA championship. But we're going to play spoiler tonight to end their season on a bad note, at least with a loss. And I know these teams are not very, you know, Focus on winning these late games when they done sold up their playoff spot. But we got something to prove, baby. Let's go. So you can see Dwight Howard there doing his pregame ritual. I'm going to shut that down. Ain't going to be none of that, young fella. So let's get it. Howard's one of the top scorers of the NBA. And Steve, he is so difficult. So they have Dwight Howard as the MVP candidate. We didn't see his name up there. Maybe they know something we don't know. It'll be fun to watch tonight. Let's see if he tries to get himself going early. And the tip off is here, and we got it, baby. Let's go, Nate Robinson. This might be the last game we see Nate Robinson as a New York Knick. It's been talked that he will be on the trade block, and he turned the ball over there, so it looks like we're going to trade him for real because that's not what we want. And he get a foul. This guy can't control himself. Come on, Nate. We need a better leader than you, maybe, to start off next year to, so we can get some more victories. And look at Dwight Howard. Takes to the paint with the contact, and it's a foul. That's all he want, man. Maybe that's not what he wants because he can't shoot free throw. Let's see if he knock him down here. Maybe in 2010, he was a great free throw shooter. Uh, he knocks down the first one, so maybe he loves to go to the line on this game. At least, maybe. He is the cover star of this game, but he does miss a free throw, and that's just like himself. And look at Nate Robinson. Come on, Nate. Do you want your position or not? He gives it to Hughes and a nice dunk there. There you go. We got to run it, baby. Y'all guys look worse than Texas Southern, man. Those are college kids. And there we go again. Nice rebound from Robinson and Stoyakovic. You better pull it, bro. You better pull it, and he knocks it down. A big shot there. We're up by four, baby. And Nate Robinson continue to push it. These guys don't know how to play Coach McGruff offense, must be. Kicks it back to Lee. Finds Hughes, pump fake, into the rack, and dunks on the White Howard, man. And look at Jameer Nelson. He was the truth back here. He was the truth. And he's going to try to get to the paint. He does to Gortat. Marcin Gortat. A lot of you guys familiar with this guy in the league today. He was a dog back then, too. And look at that. Nice block from Lee to intercept that pass or deflect it, whatever you want to call it. Look at Hughes going to the rack. Nice pass. And Stoyakovich, another three-pointer. Knocks it down, man. We're up by nine on the best team in the Eastern Conference. Got our hands on another pass. But Vince Carter pull a deep one. Misses it, but the White cleans that up. And you already know that's easy money for him. Jameer Nelson taking his time with it. Passes it. Oh, man. They save it. Can we get it? And look up Big Vince. Big Vince able to rebound that one and get two points. 
So Vince going from the baseline. My goodness, we know he got the bunnies, but man, this late in his career, he's still doing it. And look at Collison. He finds a nice one. He gets blocked, but he was able to recover that one. And he's playing his tail off to start the game. And look at Rashad Lewis, a quick three. That's his game, man. You see that form. And Harrington trying to fight his way in the paint. Collison gets blocked. We save it. Chandler kicks it to Harrington. Give it back to Chandler. He out there at the three by himself. He got a slow little jumper, but that thing be green sometimes. And look at Vince Carter going to the lane again. One hand. He switched from two to one on us. Vince Carter out there flying on us. Come on, Big Ben. Get on it. Oh, man. Ben can't even get it. And look at Rashard Lewis. He's going to get a jam himself. His team right here was the potential Golden State Warriors of today because they could run the floor with the best of them. Look at Gallinari pushing it, baby. Good way to use your body. You bigger than Vince, so you're able to get to the basket. Let's see what Gallinari got. He pulled a 3-2. Gallinari going to be a star in the future, man. I believe one more season, he's going to take off. So let's go. Look at my boy, Lewis. Golly. Rashad Lewis, man. What is you, a Golden 2010, bro? You were going crazy. In the corner, Stoyakovich, a nice three-pointer. Knocks it down. Maybe a two-pointer. I'm not sure. And Jameer Nelson. Pulls one in front of Hughes. Oh, my goodness. That could have been a foul. He still made it. And Vince Carter going with it. Looking like he going to try to get to the basket again. Nah, he throw an alley. Look at the vision. Look at the awareness. Vince Carter, too. The White Howard. And look at Brandon Bass down bottom. You let that dude. Ooh. I thought it was a block. That's a goal take. Come on, Hill. You got to know better than that. And look at Nate. Nate, can you take him out the dribble? No, sir. Hey, we done with Nate, bro. Nate, your tenure in New York is over, bro. It's over. Pass that thing down to Big Ben. Big Ben able to knock it. Oh, he missed that one too, but he was able to clean up. His second offensive rebound of the game. And Howard misses a free throw. Gortat gets it back. Jam it on us. Two guys under the basket, and he's able to get that one over him. Gallinari pull another three. I love that jumper, baby. He knocks it down again. We're up by three here. We could have been up by ten still, but... We don't want to play defense. And look at Dwight Howard and Matt Barnes making it look easy on us. Come on, Nate. Nate can't do anything, man. Nate, you better enjoy wearing the New York Knicks jersey now, bro, because you're out of here, bro. You out of here. Can't run the team. You're selfish. We're getting tired of it. And a nice drop step from Collison. We got to force Nate to get the ball up because he can't even get past his defender. Look at Harrington. He gets blocked there. No, it's a goaltender. We'll take it, though. We'll take that one. And back with it again. Come on, Chandler. Harrington, give it back to Chandler. Chandler, give it back to Harrington. We playing hot potato out there. Drop step from Collison and a nice layup. Big old Nick Collison. We might give that guy up too, man. We don't need that much depth at that power forward position. We need some shooters on our team. Yeah, look at Big Ben. Ooh, pump fake, and he fades away. I've seen that move before. It reminds me of Albert from Texas Southern. And Chandler with it. Oh, no. Chandler ain't got it. Look at Big Howard. Chandler got crossover. And a fadeaway. We could have got our hands on that one at least. And look at Gortat. These guys got two big guys that can get offensive rebounds with the best of them. You got Prime Dwight Howard and Gortat. It's hard to get rebounds on those guys. And look at Nelson pulling it up. Little short fella. Got those guys to lead. And he pulls another deep one. Knocks that down. He's on fire, man. And look at Rashad Lewis from deep himself. Fire two. Three pointers falling all over the place. We're down by 11 that quick. And look at Matt Barnes. He ain't going to pull one, is he? Nah, Lou going to pull one. He misses it. We got that one, though. Push it, man. Come on, James Harden. What have you been doing all game? You've been showing up in other, you know, special games, but not able to get anything there. And the buzzer goes off, and we're down by 11. Man, we had this team by double digits early in the game. But I guess that's why they are the number one seed come playoff time. Because these guys can fight back from adversity and get... Big shots when they need it, but we fighting pretty hard, I'm saying, to be one of the worst teams in the East. Uh, maybe because these guys are taking it easy on us, and we don't have much to lose, so they're going to just try to stay healthy, and they're going to try to just remain healthy and get on into the playoffs. So Rashard Lewis has 18 points in the first half, and we're down in struggling. Come on, guys. 55 points for us in the first half is pretty good, though. I ain't going to lie. We just got to play better defense. So Jameer Nelson right here, man. Come on, Nick. Come on, Nate. Can you do something? Oh, look at Dwight Howard. Got us. Looking crazy down bottom. Stoyakovich is out there. Rashad Lewis. Stoyakovich, Demir Nelson. Jameer Nelson knocks us down, man. Knocks it down. He pulls another one. And what else? Knocks it down. This guy's been on fire for the last 12 minutes. 
this team has shown really solid execution all Nate, That's why they have what lead. you got for us? Good screens, Lee, pass it back to Nate. Can you hit a three, Nate? Thank you. You might save your job. Psych. <laughs> Nate, come on, man. Come on, man. Give us something. We thought you were going to have a better season than you're having now. And he kicked it to Stojakovic. And Stojakovic, yo, he's an OG, but he got that stroke, man. That stroke never goes away. But he asked for too much money, man. That guy want like 20 million or 10, or I don't know. But it's too much for us, so we're not paying him. But Big Ben able to get a dunk. This is his last year with the Knicks also. It's a lot of guys y'all seeing in Knicks uniform right now that is not that are not gonna be here next year. And you can tell why. Offensively and defensively, just not cutting it, baby. And look at Chandler. Nice fade away, that young fella. We got some young talent on this team, and I like Chandler, man. That, that kid been doing his thing, you know, for the whole season, trying to help us out at least. And look at Rashad Lewis. Fake it. Dunk. You're getting killed. Come on, Nick Collison. You got to be able to block that, bro. Nate Robinson, what you got for us? Kick it back to Chandler. Chandler pump fake. See, that's what I like, man. I like Chandler, man. Chandler is going to be a star one day. I can tell. And Nate Robinson. Can't do anything. Let the guy pass the ball all the way in the lane. We got jammed on. Looking crazy out here, bro. We looking very crazy. And Nate Robinson. Pass it down to David Lee. David Lee. Oh, there you go. Knock him down. Two-hand jam. He want to flop. Let him have it. David Lee is pretty good, too. He's young also. I like him. And Brandy Bass gets to Jameel Nelson. Nate Robinson getting killed again. Defensive liability. He's too little. He's just too short, man. He's just too short. And look at Big Ben to the lane. No, Big Ben passes back to Chandler. Chandler, yes, that young player going to have a, you know, a big role in our offense next year. And good way to get your hands on that one, Gallinari. And look at Larry Hughes, his last year with us too because he's on a one-year deal. And we cannot afford to keep any old vets around. We're trying to get younger, man, and better. But Larry Hughes does his thing, though. He got that thing behind the back just now. He's not losing the step, but he's getting older, man. And these guys want big-time contracts. And look at Gortat. Pass it to the corner. Rashad Lewis knocks down a three. Man hand in his face. You can't stop that dude. Double teaming. Please come close to him at least. And look at Chandler. Chandler said, I'll match you too, bro. With a three of himself. We only down by 12. And Larry Hughes, what you got for us, baby? What you got for us? That boy's better show out. And Larry Hughes pulls a two-pointer and he knocks it down. He's pretty good, man. He's pretty good as a, you know, a backup at least. He's not a starter. And Vince Carter is in the corner. Knocks that down. Look at him, man. These guys are just playing with us out here, making us look bad. Look at Vince Carter going to the lane. Double clutch. Dunk on us. Getting sad out here, baby. Getting sad. What can we look forward to next year? It's a new revamped New York Knicks team giving you guys a preview. None of these guys that you're seeing out here, these OGs, will not be here. The first year was the toughest, and we're not going through it again. And look at Jameer Nelson. Knocks it down once again, baby. And go into the lane, step back. Come on, Nate. Oh, he made somebody fall, man. Look, ankle breaker and everything. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. That looks good. Hopefully, the next team wants you to do that for them. Let's go. <laughs> and Nate Robinson coming back with it again. Behind the back. Nice move. Kick it to Chandler. Oh, look at Chandler, man. Chandler, step back. Oh, pass that thing to Ben. That's what I'm talking about. That young fella is doing his thing. That's what we need. He could probably play point guard better than Nate. Let me stop being so hard on Nate, man. And look at Gortat. Gortat jams on him with that one, man. Nate, he's all right, though, man. Nate Robinson's all right, but he's not what we need at point guard. He's a good backup, I believe. And look at Rashard Lewis, man. Steady draining him on us. Steady draining him on us. And Rashard Lewis coming back with it again. Duncan having his best game of his career probably against us. Jameer Nelson up top with it. Rashard Lewis in his favorite corner. We're just leaving him out there. We're just leaving him out there. And there goes Dwight, jamming it, going crazy. They got too much firepower in his offense. They almost got 130 in less than three minutes left. And he kicks that one to James. James, what you going to do? Quiet, but Jagalinari pulling it, man. That kid got a jumper, man. Young kid with a nice jumper. And Petra's out there. Come on, man. Let's get a defensive stop, man. Give us something to live for. My goodness. It's been all over Tony Douglas. Made him look crazy. We haven't seen much of him this year because this is his last year also. We don't need no scrubs on our team, G's. He pulls up a mid-range jumper and he knocks it down. He can do that at the end of the game, but not at the beginning of the game. We're losing by 35. Our worst game of the year comes at the season finale. It is so sad. And 10 seconds left. I'm sorry, New York Knicks fans, that we going out sad like this. But next year will be a change. Coach McGruff will make sure of that. And will they shoot one more shot? I don't think so. And the New York Knicks season ends in a 35 Point loss to the number one seed in the conference.
These guys got a highlight of us shooting a free throw. That is very sad. That is very sad, man. What's going on here? So, let's get it. We're going to be looking forward to next season, man. Next episode will be the off-season episode. And I'm more happy to be in the off-season than I am to be in this first season. It's been pretty tough for us. But we made it through. Everybody stay healthy. We still got a young James Harden. We still got a young David Lee. And we still got a young Gallinari. And a young Wilson Chandler. All we need to do is add one more piece, man. One more piece. Maybe two. Maybe one and a half. I don't know. And I believe we're going to be in the run for a big playoff spot. And I believe we can get a championship with the mind of Coach McGruff. I think we can do anything, baby. We can probably construct a championship contending team by next year. And look at the stats of this game. It really don't matter. But, you know, Nate Robinson, his last year in a New York Knicks jersey is right now. Today, that's the last time you guys will see that. And Larry Hughes, goodbye to you also. Wilson Chandler, welcome back, young fellow. We appreciate you. Ben Wallace, I appreciate all your service, bro. You play hard, but it's time to go. And on the side, Rashad Lewis, man. Can we get him? We'll take him for one year. One year contract, Rashad. We'll get 12 me. 38 points, 8 rebounds, and 5 assists. Kid could have had a triple double. And look at Jameer Nelson. We don't want him. He's too small for me for a point guard. I know Curry is pretty small, but Curry at least 6'2, bro. 6'3, I don't know. Y'all guys tell me in the comments. Vince Carter, OG, man. We'll take him too. Going crazy. Going crazy out there. And Dwight Howard, 15 points, 13 rebounds. What more do you need from Dwight Howard when he's going crazy like that? And Gortat, 17 rebounds, man. Between those two guys, 30 rebounds. You cannot stop this team, man. I see this team probably going to the finals. But you never know. Boston Celtics is still on the East, man. They're number two seed. They might take those guys. But in the next episode, we will cover the postseason. Also, the award shows, the draft, all kind of good stuff going to be going on in the next episode. But back to it. The team stats, field goals 38% for us, sucking at shooting still. That's what's been on for us. It's been a tough first season, bro. I appreciate you guys for sticking in there with us because it's been rough for me. And 26% from the three-point line, man, we need some shooters. Free throw line, we look crazy. We look very sad. And also, the free throws made for us 10 out of 22. These guys made seven more. Even if we would have made all our free throws, we still would have got beat. <laughs> and assists 32 to 21 man i love to pass the ball but when you don't have many shooters who you gonna pass it to can't get in the post all the time one thing gonna do is clog up the lanes not gonna be much going on down there and defensively we gotta step up man turnovers these guys got nine we got 18 looking bad and look at the rebounds let's check out the rebounds these guys had 66 we had 58. We lost a lot of opportunities. You got to be able to get it, bro. But I appreciate you guys for liking this video. Hit that subscribe button if you ain't already a part of the MG fam. And hit that notification bell. And holla at your boy, Coach McGraw. We out here, baby. Let's get it. <laughs>